few weeks ago, we showed you an airport reception for the Beatles. It happened before. In 1959, after his return from Germany, Elvis Presley returned to McGuire Air Force Base in the middle of a snowstorm, a blizzard. No matter, of course, what the weather was, the Elvis fans were there in force, and the gals were outside scraping the windows, trying to get a peek at him. And as was to be expected, a great number of newsmen were there. Elvis, you have some screaming fans out there. Do you still like screaming girls? <laughs> if it wasn't for them, I'd, uh, I'd have to re-up in the Army, sir, I'll tell you. <laughs> Elvis, do you plan to make a picture about your experiences in the Army or about the Army at all? Well, my first picture is called uh, G.I. Blues, oddly enough. And uh, the story takes place in Germany. But it, it's not about my actual experiences. Uh, Elvis, there's a report that you liked the Army so much that you wanted to write a book about it. Uh, did you ever think of re-enlisting? <laughs> <laughs> No, sir, I never thought of <laughs> uh, I, I, I never thought of I never thought of re-enlisting. But uh, maybe someday I will write a book about my experiences in the army. You know. Elvis, we've heard that uh, you and a girl named Priscilla were having a love affair in Germany. Uh, has she popped the question at sleep here? <laughs> no, I'm afraid not. Uh, now, this girl that you're speaking of, I, 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 I saw her a few times, and it happened to leak out. <laughs> and uh, there was a lot of pictures made of her and so forth, but uh, it, it, was, it was no big, uh, no, no big romance or nothing like that. You know. Elvis, you're 25 now, and a lot of new young singers have come along. How do you think they're going to affect your career? Are you a little old, perhaps, for some of the teenagers now? Uh, <laughs> I don't feel too old. I mean, I can still, I can still get around pretty good, you know. <laughs> and as far as the new guys, I, I've made the statement before that uh, I think there's room for everybody. If some new guy can come along and and, uh, and get a break and make good, well, more power to him. I, I have no, uh, uh, I have no no envy or jealousy because uh, I'm only proud of the fact that I made it, you know. Nobody's heard you sing publicly in a long time. Are you still in good voice? I wouldn't say I was ever in good voice, but, but uh, uh, I did a lot of practicing that day, you know, at, at home in Germany. In fact, that, that's about all I did, because uh, I didn't go out much, and I had uh, some musical instruments and tape recorder and so forth. What so kind I of songs did you sing uh, for your friends, for yourself? Well, all types. Uh, some ballads, some rock and roll. How about, how about this adulation you get wherever you go from uh, the teenage girls? Uh, you ever get a little bit uh, tired of it and wish you could walk anonymously down the street? No, sir. I, I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't say that. How do you feel about it? Because uh, I, I'm. I, I've been in the business now for about six years, and uh, I became. I become uh, quite used to it. You know. Mm -hmm. uh, it's not. Uh, you don't think it's silly on their part? No, of course not. I was going to say it's. It, it, it's not. It's not silly or anything. I hope that you've changed your haircut. It's right. flattering, you know, and uh, there's no entertainer in the world that, that doesn't like to be uh, uh, screamed at or yelled, you know. It's appreciation. Uh -huh. Elvis, it's been two years since you've appeared before an audience. Are you apprehensive about what must be a comeback? Uh, yes, I am. I mean, I, I have I have my doubts, you know. I'm, I'm not going to, I'm not going to commit myself in saying that I'm going to do this or I'm going to do that because I don't know, actually. The only thing I can say is that uh, I'm going to try. I'll, I'll be in there fighting. You're going to stay in show business, or are you going to be an author? I'm going to stay in show business. I, uh, I, I, I can't even read my own writing. That's just <laughs> be an author. You know? That was five years ago. He's still in show business, very much so. We'll follow the career of Elvis Presley again in just a moment.